The power and groovy soca categories are returning to the International Soca Monarch Competition. This is new chairman of ISM, Fian Lyons Alvarez, promises this is the beginning of the rest of the life of the International Soca Monarch. Speaking at a press conference the day after her appointment, she said it's a daunting task, but she can't sit by and see the competition, which contributed to the development of her career, disappear. Dion Batiste has more in this report. Recently appointed ISM Chair Fian Lyons Alvarez believes the International Soka Monarch is one of Trinidad and Tobago's national treasures which should be nurtured so it can continue to grow. She said the annual competition prepared many local artists, herself included, for performances on the world stage. Soka Monarch afforded us the ability to not just perform for the people that's standing right in front of us but also the people that was looking at us via streaming possibilities, television, and now with the advent of all these social media platforms, the possibilities are endless. The competition was founded here, but has traveled to other islands where Fian said it continues to flourish, while the home event has been left to deteriorate. And at the end of the day, we're all Trinidadians, we're all West Indian, we're all Soka people. This is Caribbean country, this is Soka land. Why are we saying, well, I don't like this one to do this and this one shouldn't do this. Don't worry about who doing what. Right. Worry about what you're supposed to be doing and do that. And what you're supposed to be doing is supporting anything that's created towards promoting, elevating, employing, because Sokobonak does employ people, a lot of people, and marketing your country, your culture, and your music. Competition founder William Monroe was present and voiced his support for Fian as ISM chair. But he was critical of the government, who he said has a responsibility to do more to preserve the country's culture. It cannot go forward if the government didn't put a substantial amount of money into the product. And I must let you know, in all the islands, for that matter, those of you all who are here who travel to any of the islands, you will see the energy that they have in this Soka Monarch there now. I mean, it, it, it passed the present Soka Monarch now, but I know this one will be completely different. And I am saying, the, the reason for the success is the government in all the islands 100% support the event. He said the international Soka Monarch was the biggest showcase of Trinidad and Tobago's talent. But sadly, bad decisions resulted in poor production, which in turn caused citizens to lose faith and interest. He said Fian's appointment represents a changing tide and signals the growth and evolution of the competition. Dion Batiste, TTT News. Registration for participants in the International Soka Monarch Competition will run from January 21st to the 25th.